they do videos or something? Yeah. Oh, okay. You're beginning. I'm getting videoed. Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. I've never been one much for getting uh, photographed or video, but I'm okay. Do you wear sunglasses? Well, it's not, it's not a very Um, I did until they broke a while back. Uh, yeah. Um, you know, sometimes I'll buy aloe vera juice and put it in my eyes to kind of make them mellow out a little bit. Right. Sometimes they'll sting. Right. And I'll do that. Right. Yeah. My eyes have burned. Like uh, suddenly, my eyes will be burning. Yeah. I think my body's trying to get rid of stuff. You know, I really do. Have you ever done those uh, shoulder stands in yoga? Do you know what shoulder, shoulder stand is? No, not exactly. The shoulder stand is basically you lay on your back, back and you bring your, your legs up in the air. Oh, okay. Push your legs up in Okay. And hold your legs up. Oh, yeah, I used to do that. It's like a, you can do it against the wall, too. Yeah, I should be doing that. You're saying that's what I need to do? Yeah. Are you saying I need to wear sunglasses? Is that what you're saying on there? Well, too? no, not necessarily. It's saying you have some eye stress. Yeah, I do. And it's related to nerves. Yeah, and nerves. Nerve fibers. Yeah. So, um, it's also got it says you have some thyroid stress. So when you do the shoulder stand, it brings the blood into the thyroid. Okay. So shoulder yeah. stands. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, give you some electro physiological uh, therapy uh, when, when I manage these. And, and manage, okay. But I'm just going to give you a couple of Aloe like, for eyes. general things that are going on. With, like, and glasses would help too, you're saying? Because I have a good uh, pair of Maui gems and the polarized real yeah. glass, you know? Well, yeah. Like particular, in particular when the sun, when the sun is out. Okay, get my glasses. Yeah, because I need to fix them. I broke them, and, and they're expensive to fix, okay, and I have to do you want to write some more stuff down here? Sure. Okay, so, uh, iron in the blood. Okay. I need uh, iron? Yeah. Okay. And then cholesterol. The cholesterol is looking a little high. <clears throat> okay, so cranial bones, I have that stress there, too. And sometimes you just sort of yeah, do that. jaw down. And, yeah, yeah, do that. Push down with push up with your hand and push down with your jaw and then sideways and sort of hold it. That sort of helps the line. Up. Okay. But yeah, so anyway, there's showing a little stress there. Okay, and then uh, the liver. The liver has to show some stress. The T eight vertebrae shows a little stress. T eight? T eight. That's yeah. like the thoracic. I think that's right around where your arms are in the middle of your. So that body. could account for my hands being all. Could be, yeah. T8 vertebrae. And so what I'm going to do is just after I mention all this stuff, I'm going to just go into the therapy and see if we can reduce a little stress in those areas through the electrophysiological therapy. Okay. Um. Okay. So enzymes. Uh, particularly like uh, you know, particular what? Uh, enzymes for uh, blood blood uh, metabolism. For blood or, metabolism. Or, yeah, or blood action. Action. Like you mean like enzymatica, the the um, the um, serapeptides and all that kind of stuff that. Yeah, any kind of thing that's going to help enzymes. We can use uh, enzymatic voltmetric signature therapy as well, so we can help do some stuff electronically on you. Because they have the enzymes, the enzymatic has enzymes that are for the blood and circulation and all that. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we've seen a blood an enzyme would be good, yeah. Okay. Okay, so let's see. Major stress factors. It's saying you, you have some stress complicated with vaccination. 
Really? Yeah. I've been vaccinated since I was a little kid. Yeah. Neither have I. But it, it's showing a little stress from that. Okay. And you know about vaccinations, right? Yeah. Yeah. It, no, I, my daughter like, wasn't vaccinated, and neither yeah, okay, was my grandchildren. Yeah. Because I don't. You can do vaccinations homeopathically. So you don't necessarily have to have the, the Marisol and all that stuff that they put in there. Right. To stay on the shelf. So you can get a homeopathic remedy? Yeah, for vaccine. Yeah, I used to, when my daughter had really bad, was bad, bad sick at like a year old, yeah. um, I took her to a homeopathic doctor and, and, uh, and he studied in Greece and cured her in, in two days. She sweated all out and it was fine. It was pretty amazing. And she was never vaccinated. The, the medical doctor tried to scare the crap out of me like she was going to die. You know, <laughs> if they didn't give her what they wanted, you know. So. You ever uh, have you ever gone in for like a massage? You ever get a body massage? Yeah. Yeah. The thing about body massage is get your limbs going. Limbs so I need my lymph moving. Probably yoga does that too, but you know, you know, if you if you have a regular masseuse that might. You know, massage. They they can get into places where you don't want. I have a trampoline. Massage. Uh -huh. I have a yeah. little mini trampoline. Yeah. Okay. That helps. Yeah. I, I need to go and get on it more. I think. But my body's been so fragile and vulnerable that that I'm very sensitive to everything and careful about everything I do. Mm -hmm. You know, I just can't do anything hardly. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If that makes any sense. It's one day at a time. You know. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I mean, it's like okay, that's great. Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> um, so is it showing any kind of infection in my body? Right now what we're trying to do is sort of, uh, I haven't checked that I can do that, but right okay. now we're, just, we're trying to give you a little electrophysiological okay. stress reduction to, okay. to reduce some of the stress and the things that we just talked about. Okay. And so... So I'll focus on that. Yeah. It, It sort of has a mind of its own, but basically it could go, go for three minutes. So if you hear that, so basically when you hear the excellent, that means that your body has made an improvement. Oh, really? Yeah, it measures an improvement. So I, I respond quickly, actually. I've been told that. Uh -huh. <laughs> All I need is a little hand. Give me a little hand. Uh -huh. <laughs> I respond real That's quickly. <laughs> Okay, so So, as far as what I'm going to do is, 
I'm going to give you sort of an immune system uh, boost. Okay. You know, and, uh, and then we'll go into the fatty acid thing. I've been listening to this stuff online. Uh, to the YouTube. Uh, and you go the, for the frequencies. Uh, I've been doing that for like a couple oh, weeks yeah. now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, just like this. Very similar.
score. Score bait. Yeah. So what form do you get? Magnesium, magnesium, phosphate. I'm low in magnesium yeah, phosphate? Yeah. I get a lot of minerals, man, but maybe my body's just not absorbing the nutrients yeah. I'm taking. Okay. Magnesium what now? Magnesium phosphate. Phosphate. Okay, so chelated zinc. Chelated zinc or blowing that? Yeah. So yeah, that those the minerals are the foundation. Let me go into some herbs. Okay. Um so actually, what if you can find any herbs that are good for sort of normalized normalizing cholesterol would be good. Because it's showing your cholesterol is sort of high. Yeah. Is that why my blood pressure is wigging out? Like thump 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 through my body? Does that have to do with cholesterol? Mm -hmm.
which helps.